We used to have the expression of called pole climber, that people began at AT&T climbing telephone poles. And John DeButt started at that level and he worked his way up through the ranks and he became CEO. And he was as dedicated a patriot for AT&T as anyone you could imagine. John was a very driven person. Quite often, it was his way or the highway. But that didn't occur that often. He was a very good manager. He was a great bulldog of a man, terrified everybody in the company, terrified everybody in the industry, and was known to be invincible. And he became offended at the development of competition to AT&T. Yes, sir. We have crews on the way to the site now. DeButts believed competition was unnecessary and disruptive. Back as soon as we have an estimate on exactly how long it will be. At that time, the competition wasn't very large, but there was always a concern about it growing in the future, which obviously it did. 